having fun. I'm Mark. Hi. Hi, I'm Krista. We're back after a week off because mm-hmm. I started a new job. Yep. And I was like, I need a weekend <laughs> before I start my new job. Need some time so, to prepare and yeah. Didn't yeah. want to edit a podcast all day before I started my new job. So, yeah. so but we're back now. So our whole schedule is thrown off now. But it it's, is it's, it's, terrible. It's fine. What will we do? <laughs> so we will not be finishing. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. Our rewatch It'll in go August into the first week of September, unless we just move that Spider Man because we might get yeah. tired of MCU by that point we're and be by, like, you know what, by. let's just move that one because we may need a, a moment after Endgame because it's a big deal. It's true. You know, it's true. We just need to we just need to sit for a second. It's true. Yeah. We're also probably going to be taking a week off in September. It's true. So, so yeah. get ready for that. We'll see what's <laughs> what's around the bend. So, and then holidays will come up. <laughs> you know. Yep. Just be, prepare yourselves. Prepare we'll, yourselves. We'll do our to best, to okay, guys. Hear us occasionally. <laughs> yeah, we're we're doing our best. <laughs> There's a hundred for you to go listen to. Yeah. Go do that. Exactly. All right. Any news before we start our episode here? Secret Invasion finished, but we still haven't started that. Yeah, we haven't watched it. Yeah. I'm not hearing great things. (laughs) Yeah. (laughs) So. Well, my thought was that maybe we will cover it when we cover Captain Marvel. Okay. Since that is, you know, it's about the scrolls. A lot of scroll related stuff. stuff. And also Captain Marvel is about scrolls and Nick Fury and he plays a big part in it and everything. So I think they would probably go well together. Yeah. I guess. And don't expect us to go in depth. Oh no, no, no. We're just gonna give our thoughts about it. Probably gonna say, did we like it or did we not? Kind of thing. We're not gonna be like going deep diving into (laughs) every episode. Uh uh. Uh uh. No. Not happening. Be a five hour episode. Um so yeah, that's that's out, that's done. Um, Mm -hmm. Uh, Loki season two is coming out. In yeah, October. trailer came out. I'm so Looks excited. good. Looks real good. I can't wait. <laughs> yeah, I'm very excited. Yeah. Uh, looks like Kang's back again. Mm-hmm. So yeah, they're going back in time. Yep. Loki's going crazy. Mm-hmm. Like time glitches yeah, or something. Time glitching. He who Kwan is in it. Yes, that's who they were talking to. I couldn't. Uh-huh. I was trying to remember. I was like, uh-huh. they were talking he to showed somebody. up, and I was like, yeah. Yeah. I had heard he I was going to be in it. I didn't know. I was I had so heard, surprised. Yeah. yeah, so I was excited that he was <laughs> he was in the trailer and everything. So it's exciting. Yep. So looking forward to that. Mm-hmm. What's the next stuff that's coming out? Do we know? Marvels. Yeah, the Marvels. Mm-hmm. That's in November, I think. So it's a ways away. And then new. They're putting out more I am group things. Oh, are they? Things. Okay. Yeah, in September, I think. And yeah, I don't know. We'll see. Mm-hmm. I don't know when Echo comes out. I don't either. I'm not sure I really care that much. <laughs> I mean, her character was we'll fine, see. but. Yeah, we'll see. Maybe. Yeah. I mean, who knows? It might be one of those that, like Secret Invasion, where we just watch it and then yeah. talk about it all as one big thing. It, with yeah. Not it's in all, depth, kind of. It's all coming out at the same time. So, oh, okay. Yeah. We don't have to, like, wait. That's interesting. More than a month. Yeah, which isn't a great sign, because they were like... Echo will just all release it all at the same time, but Secret Invasion, that's going to be worth it. We're going to drag that baby out. Yeah, I have not. And then not, nobody's well, thinking I mean, Secret Invasion. I mean, I wasn't looking forward to Secret Invasion anyway, Me so. I, I don't like the scroll stuff. Anywho. Anything else? Um, anything else? I don't know when Ahsoka is supposed to come out, but that's... Yeah, I don't know. Pretty soon, I, I feel guess. like. Maybe. Maybe soon. Yeah. I feel like it is. Hopefully. Um, I mean, I want to watch it, but I don't. I feel like I'm going to be very lost in it because I haven't watched yeah, no any Clone of the Wars other stuff. Yeah. No Rebels, anything yeah. like that. <laughs> so I'm going to be completely going, who are these people? <laughs> <laughs> yeah. Because anytime one of the characters would show up in like Mandalorian or something, it'd be like, oh, that was a, that was a character yeah. I'm supposed to know. It's like I'm they're sorry. saying the name like, oh, here yeah. he is. Those are like, oh, it's, it's, it's Bish And I'm uh-huh. like, yeah. <laughs> who okay because they're like oh my god did you see him he was He's in the background here. he was like he talked he for like it. he had like three lines oh my gosh and i'm like i don't know who you're talking about like, like what was his name cad bane the bad guy that it was in like book of boba fett the uh-huh. gunslinger guy come in came in oh yeah and yeah i'm like yeah no, no, no clue <laughs> lost me there yeah. no no idea <laughs> yeah i don't even know if that's his name <laughs> I can't sounds, I, sounds I, right. I think it was that something like sounds that right. 
Oh, man. Yeah. So, yeah. I don't know. We'll see. <laughs> <laughs> I'm trying to think if there's anything else. Apparently, people are trying to find a new uh, Barbenheimer. So, oh, yeah. the next two oh, big ones, the next two big ones that are coming out at the same time yeah. is Saw, like one of the next Saw movie and yeah, Paw, Patrol. Paw Patrol. So, now they're saying Saw, <laughs> Saw Patrol. I'm like, no. So stupid. Don't do this. Yeah. Just leave it. Just leave it. <laughs> yeah. That, 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 that's not going to work. Also, there's, uh, there's going to be a new MCU in town. Oh, the yeah. The Mattel Cinematic Universe. Oh, yeah. They're We're getting Polly Pocket. We're Finally. getting a Magic 8 Ball movie. <laughs> that's so ridiculous. <laughs> so dumb. Yeah. Like, Barbie, I can understand. Polly Pocket, sure. I can see that. Barbie was a tough sell, though, at first. <laughs> yeah. But still. And I, I think the Polly Pocket one has already been in, like, they've been working on it for a while. Yeah. But, yeah. Magic 8 Ball. Magic 8 Ball. Really? Is, I can't remember what other ones. It's like they, they s- made that Ouija board movie. Yeah. Yeah, maybe they'll just do that. Maybe it'll be a horror movie with magic eight balls. I forget what they've said what kind of movie it's going to be. And really? I was like, what? It's going to be like a <laughs> it's thriller a or something. And I'm like, okay. Yeah. I can't remember what other ones they're do- They're planning on. But yeah. I'm like, no. Why? <laughs> Don't do this. Mattel, no. Don't do this. Well, spoilers for the latest Transformers movie, which I haven't seen. Okay. I haven't either. Uh, I don't care. (laughs) Yeah. But apparently they teased G.I. Joe in it. So They've made G.I. Joe movies, haven't they? Yeah, but not in the same universe as Transformers, baby. Okay. So they're bringing it all together. Okay. The biggest, the best franchise is finally coming together now. All right. I'm waiting for the Guess Who movie. (laughs) <laughs> that would be great connect for it, i mean guess who you just make it into a it's murder a mystery, mystery. Yeah, yeah exactly it's you great. can actually work with that yeah. one <laughs> just call it guess who <laughs> yep <laughs> oh boy <laughs> <laughs> all right well let's go ahead and get into our movie then yeah, okay since i can't think of anything else Oh, I, it doesn't matter if I think of anything. It's no, all you. You're done. <laughs> Thanks. <laughs> you're done. Get out. <laughs> but this is my apartment. Do you have anything else? No, I don't. Okay. <laughs> <laughs> All right. Well, this week we did Avengers Infinity War. Yeah. Yeah. So this is one you saw in the theater. Yes. Correct. Yes, me too. Uh, I remember I remember that night very well. <laughs> I don't know. <laughs> There's nothing really happening. We just saw a movie. But uh, yeah, I remember liking it very much. It's It was very shocking at the time. I'm sorry. I, I know. <laughs> on now for a second because uh-huh. you were talking about I remember it all well uh-huh. and then I just had I just had Reba McIntyre's fancy stuck in my head oh <laughs> <laughs> That did happen when I saw this. <laughs> Sorry, because there's like the very beginning of it is like, I remember it all very yeah. well. So. Just be nice to the gentleman, Mark, and they'll show you a movie. No. Um, Here's your one. Stop. <laughs> <laughs> oh, boy. Uh, yeah, so I saw this. I can't remember if I saw it twice in the theater. Mm-hmm. Or just once i think i just saw it once i know that i saw it with my mom though and that's why i can't remember because i'm like did i see it first and then i took mom to see it yeah or did i did we just go see it together right but i know that i did go see it with my mom at one point and (laughs) it was rough (laughs) yeah some sad parts it's very sad yep yeah i remember (laughs) <laughs> I remember just leaving it like, wow, I can't believe they did it. Yeah. That's crazy. I was very surprised at the end. Yeah. Because I was, I had read the comics and everything, so I knew, you know, in general what yeah. happened. But I was like, will they actually do that? We'll and it see. Was, it was very different than, than the comics. Yeah. Yeah. So. It is. So it's kind of like, well, are they going to go the same yeah, way? Yeah, exactly. It's, yeah. It's, and it, it's similar. All right. Well, uh, second watching, before we go into spoilers and everything, did you like it? Do you still recommend people watch this oh, movie? Oh, this is not my second watching. Uh, no. Rewatch, you mean? Yeah. Re- okay. Yeah. I'm like, because I, I have seen this several times. Yeah. <laughs> this is probably <laughs> this is probably the the MCU movie I've seen the most. Yeah. Maybe Civil War, but I think it's this one. Okay. Oh, I, I still love it. Yeah, it's still great. I still love it. I yeah. sat there and I was just like, "Gosh, <laughs> I love so much about this." <laughs> yeah, it's it's really fun. <sighs> so. 
All right. So I, I would I would definitely recommend it, especially I mean there's a lot of build up to it. Mm-hmm. Yeah. But yeah, I do kind of wonder like how it is if you don't know anything about it. If you were like dragged to it by a, yeah. a significant other or something, and they're like, uh, okay, who are these people? Yeah, I'm sure there are like a few movies that it would be better if you knew about before you you know before going in. Yeah. But I don't think you have to watch all of them before. No, no, probably just like the Avengers movies. Yeah. Yeah, Avengers yeah. movies, ma- uh, Cap- uh, Civil War. Yeah. I think you would probably because you're kind of you'd be like, See why? Why is nobody talking to each other? Yeah, maybe why'd the band split up? Yeah. Guardians, first Guardians. Yeah. Maybe second. Yeah. Definitely first. Yeah. But. Yeah. So. Yeah. But we knew it all going yeah. in. So. <laughs> yeah. We were ready. All right. So what happened in this movie? Well, we start in space. In we space. hear. Well, first it's like there's no sound. Yeah. We thought. I was maybe like, we had it muted. I was like, it, uh, did we mute it on accident? <laughs> I Oops. forgot. But yeah. no, it starts with no sound. And then you hear a distress call uh-huh. from the Asgardians. Yeah. Just saying that they're, uh, they're not a warship. They're just a civilian ship yep, and civilians on there yep and they're so so far away from asgard yeah and like you know sending out their location and everything uh-huh. and yep and <laughs> then we get to the ship yep it is messed up yep it's been blown up a lot by mm-hmm. thanos's ship there are dead people everywhere yep and we saw them. We saw dead people. I see dead people. <laughs> <laughs> okay, yeah. We there were dead people. Yes, they were. They were as guardians or as guarded dying. Can you please cut that out? <laughs> Can you please edit that out of this podcast? No. It's, what? <laughs> <laughs> So bad. <laughs> I'm not laughing because it's funny. I'm I know. Because of how horrible that was. Yeah. It made no sense. Yeah. Oh my gosh. Yeah. <laughs> you ruined this whole movie for me now. Thanks. So we go inside mm-hmm. the ship as guardians. They're down everywhere. Yep. They're dead. The first one, the first person we see yeah. is Heimdall. Yeah. He's, he's he's all right. He's alive, but yeah. he's on the ground. Yeah, like he's, he's dying. Hurting. He's hurting. Yeah, Ebony Maw is there. He's walking mm. around. Yeah, he's talking. Saying what a joy it mm-hmm. is to get to die. For I can't Thanos. stand this guy. Yeah, <laughs> he's the worst. <laughs> Which I mean, all of Thanos's cronies, his children of Thanos, yeah, they're a, all annoying. But Ebony Maw's a creepy little dude. I don't like him at all. Yeah, I really don't like him in the comics too. Honestly, he's so much more annoying because mm. he's like very he can like he can influence people with his words and stuff and kind of hypnotize them a little bit yeah. And even like, I think he dies and his ghost does it. And he's, he's real annoying. <laughs> like, come on. Yeah, he's super annoying. <laughs> You're dead. Just get get out of here. <laughs> just be dead. The other children are Proxima Midnight. Mm-hmm. She's a lady. <laughs> yeah, and she's then... <laughs> a lady. <laughs> Corvus Glaive. Corvus just... Glaive, whose name I can never remember. <laughs> yeah. And also, I don't like him. Yeah, they're they're... A romantic couple. Yeah. Pretty hot. There's something about the way he moves that just annoys the it just annoys me. Yeah. I watch him walking around. I'm just like, oh, don't like it. I don't think I noticed his walking at all. <laughs> I don't know. There's something about his movements that just throw me off. <laughs> and then Call Obsidian, mm-hmm. who I never remember because I just think of his comic book name is Black Dwarf. So, mm-hmm. okay. yeah, I'm like, who is he again? It's Call Obsidian. He's a big boy. Okay. Doesn't really talk. Doesn't speak English, at see, least. See, I just remember him because it's like Ebony. And. Ivory. Ivory. Yeah, because, you know, Ebony, uh-huh. Midnight, yep. Obsidian, uh-huh. they're all dark. Glaive. And then I'm like, what is... Who's the other guy? What is Cor- <laughs> Corvus Glaive? Yep. How is... What does glaive mean? Uh, is, I know Corvus is like a raven, so I guess that could be like the black part of it. There but, you go. That's but, it gotta be it. Come on. <laughs> I was gonna <laughs> just think... Raven, Corvus, okay. <laughs> you know, only the only the best people. Apparently, Glaive is an American singer songwriter. So, but yeah, that's what I thought. It's like it's like his weapon is a glaive. I thought that's I thought it was yeah. a weapon, but yeah, okay. It's a pole arm. Mm, that makes so much sense. Now. <laughs> He's got a pole arm. Okay. All right. So they're all there. Thanos mm-hmm. is there. Thor and Loki are there. Yep. Thor's not doing too well. No, Thanos has killed almost everybody on that yeah. ship. Yeah. 
Already. He's stomping on Thor's body. Yep. He has the power stone. Yeah. Look, he's like, hey, bud, good to see you. Yeah. We did it. Mm hmm. Hell to Thanos. Because, of course, Loki used to work <laughs> was for him. Working for him he yeah. was the one who did the whole attack on New York and everything. Mm, yep. Yeah. Regret that now. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. <laughs> so he starts trying to kill Thor. Mm hmm. Thanos, not Loki. Yeah. Thanos is killing Thor, basically. Yeah. Because he's but like, it, he's I'm, looking for the Tesseract. Yeah. He's like, give me the Tesseract or I'll. I'll kill your brother. Yeah. Thor's like, ha, it's, it's gone, but yeah. it got destroyed with Asgard, you idiot. Yeah. You look stupid right now. And then Loki's like, you mean this Actually, Tesseract? <laughs> yeah. It's like, dang it, Loki. Yeah. Because, of course, he grabbed it at the end of mm-hmm. uh, Ragnarok. Yep. Because it was there in the in the little room. Treasure room. Treasure room. Yeah. He's like, oh, I'll just <laughs> Mine? smash that. Yep. Thank you. Um, so yep. Thanos crushes it, gets the space stone out of it. Yep. And yeah, adds it to his Well, technically, bef- before he before oh, he yeah. spaces before he spaces it. Yeah. Before he gets it. Um, Loki's like, oh, we he's like, I ha- we have the Tesseract, <laughs> but we also have a Hulk. Yeah. And Hulk goes to attack. What was Hulk doing while everybody else was dying? He was Where hiding, was he at? I guess. I don't know. I don't know. What was he hiding? I don't know. It, it, yeah. <laughs> There's there are several moments in this <laughs> like, movie where that I'm is like, everybody? why why is this character not here? Because yeah. this character should be here. Yeah. Um, especially at the very end, which uh-huh. we will talk about. Yeah. Uh, but yeah, they have a Hulk. So Hulk yeah. comes out. He starts fighting with Thanos. Thanos yeah. just... Yeah, he turns the tide pretty quick and just starts beating up on the Hulk. So he just beats Hulk up. Yes, he does. Um, he because I guess he's got the power stone, so you know he's very powerful. he's very powerful. <laughs> but Thanos, even without the stones, is he's, super yeah. powerful anyway. So exactly, but so it's uh, not helpful. So Hulk is not doing well. Yeah, and Heimdall is like, "All right, this is my last chance, probably, to use mm-hmm. Bifrost. I'm going to get the Hulk out of here." Yep. So and he does. He shoots him away. Yep. So Hulk is gone. He's on his way somewhere else. Yep. That was um, like big mistake. Yeah. Stabs him through the heart. Huge. Huge. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. And stabs him. So Heimdall's dead. And I'm like, wow. Wow. You're just going to kill Idris Helma mm-hmm. like that? Okay. Yeah. I was surprised. Okay. <laughs> I was like, well, at least they're not going to kill anybody else. They they wouldn't kill more than like one big character. <laughs> I mean, they've got, they just killed Heimdall. They're yeah. not going to do anything else. Other All these that, useless Ad- Asgardians nobody cares about, and then yeah. I'm dull. Yeah, exactly. Like, ah, oh, that's rough. So how are our heroes getting out of this one? Uh, well, one of, another one is not getting out. Of there. <laughs> <laughs> but uh, yeah, so he has the he has the tesseract. He crushes it. Yeah, he's got the space stone now. So mm-hmm. there we go. He's like, he sends his his guys out. He's like, there are two stones on Earth. Go find them. So mm-hmm. they head out. Meet me at Titan. Mm-hmm. We'll party. Yep, we'll just have a big party on Titan. Yep. Look He's like, how can I help, buddy? He's like, he's like, I I've can got go so with much information. I can go experience. with them. I can be a guide. Yeah. I can show them where to find all this stuff. It's all a ruse, of course. Yeah. He's just trying to get close to Thanos so that he can stab him. Yep. And he gets close. He does, but he also. He projects what he's going to do. So yeah, he telegraphed it really. Te- early. Yeah, that's what I was trying to say. Telegraphed yeah. it really well. So it's like he knows that you're about to stab him. Yeah, <laughs> I mean everybody knows you're about to stab him, Loki. Yeah, I thought you were better at better than this. Uh, so he tries to stab him and uh, does work. not go well. And um, snaps his neck basically yep. from so, Thor. Yep. So I was like, what? He's not really dead, right? <laughs> like there were so many what? theories after this. Yeah. That he was still alive yeah because he didn't turn blue right after he died yeah. because he's a frost giant so of course when he dies he should turn blue right but he didn't yeah but he looked pretty dead. but he was dead <laughs> he was pretty dead yeah. Yeah. and so far we haven't really gotten anything to say he's not dead no so. because i mean while we do still have loki yeah. it's loki from a different timeline yeah so and he saw you know in loki he saw like his death on yep. the screen and everything yeah so, so. i don't i don't I think he's dead. He's dead. <laughs> yeah. So couldn't believe it. Yeah, That's this was crazy. Exactly. In the theater, I think I think this was like the part where everybody was just like, oh no, <laughs> this is gonna get bad. And all of the Loki yeah. fangirls were crying, I'm sure. Yeah. I was Me. not, because I was not a Loki fangirl at that point. I I, I was I was surprised. I was, I was kind of upset, but mm-hmm. also like, surely not. Surely not. But um, but then I was like, well, if he is dead, good news. Nobody else is going to die. We're fine. So. <laughs> <laughs> you know, you would think that would be sound logic. Yeah. But no. Yeah. <laughs> 
So Thanos blows up the ship as he leaves, and he's yep. like, deuces, Thor. He's See like, ya. I'm outie. Yeah. And he's gone. Bye. So the ship explodes, and my first note was, where were the other Asgardians? Yeah, I guess they got out somehow. Yeah, they had to have, because they yeah. said, he says at some point that they killed half the Asgardians. Who does? I don't remember who says it, but somebody I says thought, it. like, um, I don't think anybody says it in the movie. I thought they did. I thought Thor said it. Mm, maybe. I don't know. But I mean, like, Valkyrie's not yeah, there. Yeah, Valkyrie's not there. So, yeah. Because I... I didn't Obviously, think, uh, Matt I didn't, Damon and Luke Hemsworth are not there because they show up. Yeah, and- <laughs> the most important as Guardians. <laughs> I don't think they said it because I remember them the Russo brothers doing interviews afterwards and people asking them like where are there other Asgardians did anybody survive like I swear I like, thought I heard yeah. somebody say it in there though uh, maybe when we watched it I but... don't ever remember it happening I don't know but yeah so oh I have a note on this okay when it, it, we'll get to it later it's when he's talking to the Guardians he says Thanos okay. killed half his people okay so he does say it okay I guess they had another ship inside that ship or something I, I guess don't know. it's a pretty big ship and yeah. they could have because like Loki used another ship to go grab everything and get out. So they had another that, ship. That was that ship. No, it was another Wasn't one. It? There were two ships. They were like the one they were loading everybody up in. That, and then I thought Loki. that was the big ship. No, there's two ships. Okay. Yeah. Anyway. Because it showed them all in one ship at the end of Ragnarok. Yeah, they all yes. met up at the end. Yeah. Okay. But I think there was another ship. I thought there was only one because it was the one that Loki and Korg and everybody came in on. Yeah, they did come in on it. Yeah. But then, yeah, the other things happened. Like, they showed up on it, but Loki had to go do other things, like raise Surtur. Yeah. And he had his own ship. That's like a tiny ship. I don't know. Maybe they packed him in. I don't know. (laughs) I don't know. I thought that was like the ship that uh, that Thor and... love. That Thor and Valkyrie had come in on, but I don't know. I think that one got destroyed. Maybe. Who knows? Anyway. Um, Whatever. Doesn't really matter. Apparently, half of them got out. Apparently, there. so. So then we're at the. Is this where do we go to Doctor Strange next? Yes, because Hulk. Uh, we see Hulk lands in the mm-hmm. Sanctum Centaurum. Yeah, Doctor Strange and Wong. We're just gonna about to go to the deli get some yep. sandwiches, but I guess because they're Wong gonna be hungry for a while. <laughs> Wonger wants a tuna melt. <laughs> yeah, so he's not gonna get that tuna melt nope. for a little while. But yeah, he he crash lands in there. Mm-hmm. And it's like Thanos is coming. Yep. Get ready. And they're like, who? <laughs> <laughs> so uh then we go to there's a park. Yep. Tony and Pepper are there, they're walking, they're talking. Yep. He says uh he's talking about a dream that he had the night before where they had a kid named Morgan. Uh-huh. And he's like, Was it really a dream? She's like, Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> we don't have a kid. We're not even married. You know. But they're about to get married. They're probably. engaged. They're engaged. Yep. Yeah. So, and then Doctor Strange shows up. Yep. Says, "Tony, need mm-hmm. you. Come on." Yep. Bruce is like, "Hey, Tony, I'm back." Please come. Please come help. Please help us. <laughs> so they go back to the Sanctum. Yeah. Uh, they're talking about. Well, Wong is uh, explaining the Infinity Stones, basically. Yeah. And so there are six of them. Uh-huh. Space, reality, power, soul, mind, time. Yep. Time one is the one that is in the Eye of Agamotto. Yep. So, of course, Doctor Strange does his little thing and he's like, oh, let me show is. it to so, you. Here it is right here. On I've the- got mm-hmm. one. We Look at me. It. So cool. Yep. Yeah. And <laughs> Tony's just kind of like, Mm, okay so we'll just protect it or we'll just we'll get rid of it or whatever yeah and dr strange doesn't want like to. he's like i'm supposed to we're supposed to be the protectors we're supposed to protect it yeah and uh tony's like well i was supposed to go dairy free but then ben and jerry's <laughs> made a flavor named <laughs> after me yeah uh stark raving hazelnuts yeah <laughs> he's like but it's Wong like, liked the Hulk flavored, mm. whatever it was. Yeah, hungry, I can't remember what it was. Hulk. <laughs> Something like that. <laughs> I can't remember. Oh, man. It's so funny. <laughs> yeah. Yeah, so he's like, Hunk no. of Hulk a burning something. <laughs> I don't know. I don't remember. Anyway, <sighs> doesn't know. matter. <laughs> But yes, they start hearing stuff going down outside. Yep. They're like, what's going on? Well, also, they're like, Bruce is like, well, you know, we can just get every, we can just get all the Avengers to, oh, yeah, to protect it or whatever. Yeah. Just call up Cap. Let's go. Exactly. Get the team. Tony's like, eh, you <laughs> kind of miss a while. Yeah, you've been gone a while, buddy. You're gone. But uh, he's still got that little flip phone. Yeah. With Cap's name. And he's like, the Avengers broke up. He's yeah. like, like a band? Yeah. <laughs> 
broke up like a band. Yeah. Uh, yeah. So that's when they hear and they start hearing everything outside. Yeah. People are going crazy. He's about they're, to call Cappy. He's, yep, to he's so button. close. He's so but close. That, there's stuff going on outside. Yep. They gotta go outside. Everybody's running around the streets. Yep. They look out there. The streets. <laughs> they look out there and there's this big spaceship that's coming in. Yeah, big wheel. circle <laughs> thing. And then we move over to Spider Man, Peter Parker. He's mm-hmm. on the bus with his classmates. Yep. They're crossing the bridge. Yeah. And he sees, well, he feels it first. He gets that. He gets that Spidey his sense. Spidey sense finally and shown in the, mm-hmm. in the movies. That was so, exciting. I remember seeing that the trailer be like, yeah, yeah. Spidey so, sense. So he has this little goosebump moment kind of thing he's like yeah. well, he looks over and he sees it and he's like oh gosh ned help me out you've yeah. got to cause a distraction <laughs> ned's like ah oh, <laughs> aliens we're all gonna die <laughs> so um yeah everybody starts and then the bus driver's like y'all haven't seen aliens before <laughs> exactly and it's stanley it's stanley <laughs> yeah uh, yeah so while everybody's distracted he gets out of the bus he- yeah flings himself out through the emergency exit and yeah he gets heading toward where all the the action is yep they see cold obsidian and ebony Ebony maw yep there he's like earth today's your lucky day Mm -hmm. you get to all become children of thanos or whatever lucky dogs yeah and they're like "Mm, no earth's closed (laughs) earth's closed you gotta go (laughs) Uh, yeah yeah. so he knows that dr strange has one of the stones so mm-hmm. they're trying to get it from him yeah tony's got a nanotech suit now mm-hmm. pretty cool pretty cool like yeah it. bruce can't turn into the hole can't turn into the hole he's just trying won't come out he's trying so hard and Hulk's yeah. like nah ain't doing <laughs> it you're embarrassing us in front of the magician in front of the, the wizard <laughs> so, yep. yeah they he's fight just, a lot yep there's yeah there's a lot of fighting spider-man joins in mm-hmm. they're all fighting mm-hmm. i think that it's at washington square but i'm not really sure because i meant to look it up but i think it one point it looks like they go through the there's a building there that's like a little angle i forget what okay. it's called flat iron building that's what it's <laughs> oh, called yeah, the they go iron. through uh they go through it and okay i'm pretty sure that's washington square anyway so yep they're doing all the they're doing all the fighting yeah they send <laughs> fighting everywhere Cole obsidian into another place yeah i'm not sure where he's at yeah. Yeah, through one of the... Uh, Wong sends him through, through a portal. Mm-hmm. He tries to come back out and it they slashes close off it. his hand. <laughs> yeah. And then everybody uses this later on to think, but I still don't think it would work, but whatever. What? For later on with Thanos when they're fighting him. Oh, oh. But I still don't. Yeah. Because hmm. it's completely different. It's a different situation. Is it though? Yes, because he <laughs> makes a portal, he goes into it. They doesn't form a portal around That's his arm. That's true. He would have to. Unless they like moved his arm into a portal and yeah. like did all this. It would be ridiculous. He but would anyway. have to, he would have to like, because Cole Obsidian is like reaching up. He's yes. trying to get through, back through the portal. Yes. And when it closes. Right. And is Thanos really going to do that? No. With the gauntlet? No. I mean, I guess if they were if they were on Titan and they were doing where they had him, like, later, where they have him, like... Even still, you, but, they would have to move him around. Yeah. They could barely move him. And they yeah. would have to, like, move his hand into a portal, insert it. Yeah. It would... No. I'm sorry. It's not going to work. It's stupid. So <laughs> shut up already. Okay. I'm so tired of everybody saying that. <laughs> Oh, anyway, man. back to it. Uh, he, he eventually gets Doctor Strange like pinned up against a building. Mm-hmm. He grabs the Eye of Agamotto and it just burns the crap out of him because he has a spell on it. Yeah. He's like, <laughs> yeah. yeah it's, it like leaves stuff on his hand. It, yeah. It's a real Indiana Jones. It is. <laughs> <laughs> it's a real Raiders of the Lost Ark. It uh, is. A situation here. Yeah. And the cape rescues him mm-hmm. cape's going full full character mode here he's, oh, yeah. he's a whole nother avenger yeah exactly point. <laughs> exactly if he's not he should be i love yeah. that cape that cape's amazing cape is great so yeah it gets him out of a couple of little situations there sticky situations mm-hmm. and then of course spider-man is there he's also trying to help out yeah and he gets hold of strange with his webbing and everything mm-hmm. but it doesn't really help when the spaceship has like a tractor beam kind yeah. of thing and starts pulling dr strange in yeah. and oops. nothing he can do about it <laughs> nope. so he kind of goes with him he gets yep. teleported up with him yep he doesn't go inside of the spaceship though he's just kind of like yeah um Attached webbed onto to the, the back <laughs> onto yeah. the side of it or whatever iron man shoots up there Mm -hmm. to help out because it's going up into space yeah and he gets friday to release one of his 
or a, a suit. We yeah. don't know what it is. 17A. Mm-hmm. And it flies up there. And it's a new suit for Spider-Man. Yeah. So it it's hits him. Iron and... Spider suit, kind of. Mm-hmm. So, um. Uh... And he's like, send it back to Earth. <laughs> and then yeah. A parachute comes out and it starts flying away. Yeah, That's but he doesn't go funny. back. He doesn't go back to Earth, though. Yeah, he, he shoots a it. web. Mm-hmm. Because it's very, it's a very intuitive suit. It mm-hmm. knows what he wants to do and does it. So, yeah. so uh, Tony goes into the ship, uh-huh. and Peter ends up in there too at some yep. point. So they're both in there, and Capey, Capey, and the Cape, yeah, of, of course, Cape Man, yep, and uh, Man Cape. Pepper. <laughs> Stop. <laughs> And Pepper calls Tony and is uh-huh. like, oh my God, are you seeing what's happening? Are you yeah. okay? And he's, he's like, like, yeah. Yeah, I'm not going to be home I'm for not, a bit. Yeah. Uh, that reservation we have for dinner, you might yeah. want to cancel it. I'm not going to be there. She's like, she's like, you better not be in that spaceship. <laughs> Tony, you <laughs> tell me you're not in that spaceship. Yeah. And he's like, mm, Yeah, they get disconnected though. Yep. And so. he loses Friday also. Yep. So he's on his own. Or at least he thinks he's on his own. But of course, Peter is there. So. Yeah. But uh, yeah, there we go. They're flying off into space. Yeah. Then somewhere else in space, we have Guardians of the Galaxy. Mm -hmm. They're flying around. They've heard a distress signal that they're going to check out. Yep. And of course, it's the Asgardians. Mm -hmm. This distress signal that we heard earlier. Bodies around. Yep, because they find it. There's just just stuff everywhere. Yep. They're like, oh, this is not good. Mm-hmm. Uh, I guess we're not getting paid. <laughs> <laughs> but then somebody hits the windshield. Yep. It's Thor. It's Thor. He opens his eye. They're like, oh my God, he's alive. Mm-hmm. So they bring him in. They're like, it's a dude. And it's like, no, this, you're a dude. <laughs> it's this a is man. a man. They say it's like a pirate had a baby with an angel. <laughs> They're just all enamored. <laughs> yeah, they love him. Uh, uh-huh. And he well, wakes up. All love him. <laughs> yeah. Yeah. Peter does not love him. Yeah. Um, Mantis wakes him up. Yeah. She she talks about how he's gone through a lot of anguish and guilt mm-hmm. and stuff like that. So, yeah. Yep. He's in a bad mood. Yep. So this is where he says that Thanos killed half his people and he's trying to find the other stones. Yeah. And there's a stone at nowhere or on nowhere. Mm-hmm. It's the reality stone because we did see that yeah, was in like Yeah, they gave it to the collector. Yeah. And yeah. So that's where they need to be headed. Yeah. But he's like, but uh, he actually, go we're going to go to... Mm-hmm. Need a Valir. Yeah, where they make the biggest weapons. Yes, that can they kill make like, the weapons of the gods and yeah. stuff, basically. So he's like, I, I need to go there. I need a new weapon. I don't mm-hmm. have my hammer anymore because, of course, it was destroyed. Yeah, and um, Rocket's like, I need to go there as well because yes, that's awesome. Because that sounds amazing. <laughs> and Peter's like, you just want to go there because you know Thanos isn't going to be there. And he's like, No, <laughs> yeah. I just want to go because it seems cool. Yeah. <laughs> so he's like, And Groot's coming with us. So yeah. Thor, Rocket, and Groot head off, and the others go on to nowhere. nowhere. Yep. Then we have Wanda and Vision. They're Uh together. They're in Scotland. Yep. Vision is... He's phased himself to look like a human instead of... Full Paul Bettany mode. Yeah, exactly. Yeah. He's going full Paul Bettany. (laughs) Yeah, Um, it's ridiculous. Yeah, so they're obviously trying to make it as a couple. Yeah, they're on the run, kind Mm -hmm. of hiding out. Yep. Uh, They're walking down the street. They happen to see there's like a store with like a TV in it. Mm -hmm. And it's showing footage from the fight in New York. And they're like, oh, crap. Uh (laughs) Uh-oh. Well, I guess it was fun while it lasted, yeah. and Vision's and like... Vision's supposed to be checking in with Tony, but yes. apparently he, like, took off his, like, transponder or yeah. whatever, yeah. whatever it's called. So they haven't heard from him in a yeah. while. Yeah, they've kind of gone rogue. Yep, and, yeah, so he's like, I gotta go... I need to go help out and everything. He's about to leave when suddenly he's stabbed from behind. Mm -hmm. And it's Corvus Glaive. (laughs) Yeah. Yeah, got it. (laughs) Raven polearm himself. (laughs) Raven polearm himself. Exactly. So it's Corvus Glaive. Corvus Glaive. And Proxima Midnight is also there. And what? Oh, yeah. His weapon, like, messes with his ability to... To phase. Phase, yeah. Yeah, Because he turns back into, like, vision. Yeah, because it's made of... What is it made of? I want to say it's like Uru or something. Uru? Oh, no. <laughs> Why? The same thing that Thor's hammer's made out of. But okay. I could be wrong about that. It might be something else. But it's made of something special. Yeah. So anyway, he, he can't get away, basically. Yeah. Because he can't, like, I guess he can't fly at this point anymore, too, because he's too injured. Yeah. 
Scarlet Witch has to keep saving him. Yep. <laughs> they so. keep they keep just knocking her back and then just beating up on Vision. Yeah. Just like, oh. Because they're yeah. trying to get the stone out of his head. Yeah. So, of course, Corvus Glaive just keeps trying to get it out. Just poking it with his yep. stick. Just like, Come on. Give me, give, give me that. Do give me that. <laughs> yep. So he's trying to, like, it looks like somebody taking a can opener or something. Yeah. He's trying to, but he's like poking it right ones. in the middle of it. Yeah. It looks like it's just going to break it. It's like, no, you have to get it on the side <laughs> yeah. and, like, go under. It's yeah. like, Come on. Pry it out, man. It, it's just like those infomercials when you see people trying yeah. to like flip an omelet and they go straight for the middle of it. And yeah. It's like, why are you trying to flip an omelet like that? You know that's are not going to work. Are you tired of omelets not flipping from the middle? <laughs> it's like, <laughs> who said they ever did that? I don't know. It's so annoying. I don't like infomercials. <laughs> They're ridiculous. Obviously. So, Scarlet Witch. I keep... She's not Scarlet Witch, technically, at this point. She's Wanda. Wanda. Yeah. Uh, Wanda grabs him and tries to get him out of there. Mm-hmm. Flies off. They go into a train station. They get hit by something. Like, one, like one of the two hit him with some something. I don't know yeah, they got blasted. Yeah. From Proxima Midnight's pole arm of choice. Whatever. It's, it's some, like, energy sword thing. I don't know. Yeah, so they get blasted with it and fall into a train station. Mm-hmm. And, of course, bad guys show up there start yep. fighting them more Vision's like you've got to go you have to leave me here she's yeah. like I'm not going to sacrifice you yeah and then uh, the train comes by because they look off and they're like what so I I sense something. Yeah. There's a disturbance in the train there's, station. There's a disturbance in the force. And yeah, because a train goes by. And yeah. when it comes back, there's somebody. Oh, he's all shadowed. All over there. I, I was so excited there. in the theater. Oh I was like, God, I it's to... Cap. Oh, Cap's here, baby. I love Cap so much. We're going to be okay. <laughs> and nobody else is going to die. Cap's here. And so one of them, I forget which one, if it's her or if it's him, yeah. one of the two bad guys, throws something over there to him. Mm-hmm. He catches it. Yeah. And then he comes out of the light, basically, out into the light. And it's like, yeah, oh, yeah. it's a cat. <laughs> and he's got yeah. a beard. He's looking good. <laughs> there were cheers in the theater when we saw it. Yeah. It was, it was, it was a big deal. It, we saw it in a big theater. Mm-hmm. It was in Phoenix. And it was one of the theaters. There were like certain theaters where people were just super loud and would just yell constantly yeah. about stuff. Sometimes it works and sometimes it ruins stuff. But mm-hmm. in this one, it, it worked. <laughs> there was it depends people on, were cheering. Yeah, it depends on if they're if how disturbing people are being, basically, or disruptive. Okay, <laughs> disturbing. <laughs> yeah, people were being pretty disturbing. They're being so disturbing. They're like, oh, it's cappy. Yes. <laughs> it's just disturbing you. Okay. Look at his little tushy. Stop it. Oh god, what? stop. It was disturbing. I meant like disturbances, but yes, you know. Yeah, I know. Um, they're disruptive. Yes, uh, it depends on how disruptive they are. If it's like they're cheering because Cap shows up for the first time. Yeah. You know, it's different. It was great. So he shows up. He starts fighting them. Then Falcon comes in. He's yep. fighting them. Black Widow shows up. They're mm-hmm. all there. The gang's Every- all here. Everybody's here. Yep. And uh, so Corvus Glaive gets stabbed at one point. Mm-hmm. And they're like, we're gonna just leave. Fine. We'll be back later. We'll go. So they get out of there. Yeah, they teleport out. Yep. And they teleport into their little ship and just fly mm-hmm. off. Yep. They get away. Then they're like, they got to fix up vision. And mm-hmm. But wait, no. When does that all? Maybe, maybe they just cut away after that. They're they sit. They're in the in a Quinjet, and they say they're heading home. So okay. Then we go back to well, technically we have a flashback, and we get to see Gamora's backstory. Mm-hmm. So we see Thanos when he came in and to her planet was killing yep, everybody. He attacked there, killed half of the people there. Mm-hmm. Just lined them up half on one side, yep. half on the other. And it was like he told them to choose too. And it's like, how do you know? It's like just choose a side. It's like, and you don't know which one. You're just like hoping for the best. Yeah, <laughs> yeah, it's pretty much. It's up. not like a lottery kind of thing where it's like they yeah. choose for you. It's just you choose yourself, and well, <laughs> but uh, he takes a special interest in. Yeah. Gamora. He does. She's she's a fighter, I guess. She doesn't really do that much, honestly. She's like stop and tries to hit yeah. the guy and then that's about it that's about it yeah yeah she's looking for her mom and that's yeah about it. he takes her over to the side and he shows her this knife. dagger thing yeah a little double-sided double-sided knife. yep and he talks about of course it's perfectly balanced as, as all, things all things should, things be. should be yeah it's like okay yeah so then we get back to present day where and they just shoot all the oh yeah they half shoot half of them. Them. Yeah. yeah i'm sorry I forgot to say that she, they kill half the people yeah 
then we get back to the ship, like modern day, where uh, she's with Quill mm-hmm. and tells him, you know, I need a favor. If Thanos gets me, you have to kill me. Yeah. And he's like, I'm not going to do that. I have something that he needs. Yeah. And yeah. Exactly. I know I have some information that he needs. If he gets it, everybody's going to die. And he's like, well, shouldn't you like tell me what it is? Yeah. <laughs> he's like, no, <laughs> I need you to kill you me. don't if, get this. It's like. It's like I I just need you to promise me that if he if he captures me that you will kill me before he can get the information. Yep. And then he's like, "All right, I, I'll do that." And yeah. then you hear crunching in the background. And it's like, <laughs> "What is happening?" They look over. Drax is just standing there eating yeah. some dark nuts. Mm-hmm. And he's like, "They're like Drax, what what are you doing?" He's like, "I'm invisible." Yeah, I've controlled my movements to be mm-hmm. so imperceptible that I can turn invisible. Yeah, exactly. <laughs> and he's like, watch. And he slowly brings, slowly a, brings him a dog nut. nut and starts eating it. <laughs> Mantis comes in and is like, hey, Jax. And he's like, dang it. He yeah. just walks off. But how long had one. he been there? Because yeah, <laughs> they didn't he might know have been he was there. For a while. It's hard to say. Because <laughs> yeah, he just he did just kind of come out of nowhere. Yeah. So Because he was like, I've been here for like an hour. <laughs> it's yep. like, had he? Really? Because if so, <laughs> maybe he can. I don't know. But they arrive in nowhere. They see... Thanos is there. He's talking to the collector. The collector's uh-huh. like, I don't have the reality stone anymore. I, I sold, it. sold it to someone. I didn't know what it was. Yeah. And he's like, mm, no. You're lying. <laughs> You're lying. Yeah. You're lying. I know you would know <laughs> what it is. Drax tries to go off and kill Thanos mm-hmm. by himself, and they stop him. Yeah. And they put him to sleep. Yep. And he falls down. Yep. And just clanks. They're like, not a good plan. Because they're like, we've got to, we need to get the stone before Thanos can get to it. Yeah. So you can't go after him right now or whatever. Mm-hmm. And then Gamora immediately goes after him. Yeah. So what was the point? I mean, it, <laughs> the, their cover was blown once they. Drop, That's true. Drags down. That's true. So yeah, it wasn't gonna happen anyway. Yeah. So Gamora goes up. She ends up stabbing. Thanos. Yeah. Stabs him in the neck. Um. He falls over. He's like, "Why?" I loved you. Yeah. Bye. Bye. And then he dies, and the movie's over. Yeah. It was a great movie. It was you great. Know? <laughs> it was, uh, so it was thought, kind of weird that it was so short. Yeah. It's but, weird they killed Loki and everything. Yeah. It was like, wow, <laughs> wow, they really killed Loki, and then they yeah. just immediately got rid of Thanos like that. I wonder what I mean, how the other people are gonna. Take it's like now. there was a lot of build up to kind of nothing you i guess know? we got to see how proxima midnight does yeah so we'll yeah. probably go look at her now never mind uh, it was all fake we got it you was all fake we got you idiots <laughs> uh, yeah he was using watch the- a movie every once in a while dummies <laughs> he was using the reality stone he the was. whole time yeah none of it was real no everything's on fire yep. and they didn't feel that fire somehow <laughs> right <laughs> a reality stone is real good yeah so yeah, it was it was all a ruse, mm-hmm. and um, they try to attack him again. Mm-hmm. Drax he turns him into a bunch of cubes. Yep. And yep. Mantis turns into little spiral cubes. Yeah, <laughs> she looks like she's been she got spiraled. Spiraled. Uh, that's very. It's like a shout out to the comics. Because Drax does get turned into that. I think maybe Captain America gets spiraled like Mantis does. Weird. I don't remember for sure who it was, but yeah. So so we've had somebody cubed. We've had somebody spiraled. We mm-hmm. have somebody spaghetti at yeah. some point later. Yeah. So, wow. Yeah. <laughs> oh, Mr. Fantastic. Mm-hmm. And then he's got Gamora. He, yep. And Star-Lord comes confronting up. him. Yep. He comes up. He's, he's going to shoot Thanos. Yep. And Gamora says something to him. She's like, not like, him. Not him. And it's like. Okay, just, just give away your broadcast plan. everything. <laughs> yeah. You know, here we go. Just yeah. telegraphing your whole plan, like like Loki did. It's yeah. Like, what is wrong with you people? Yeah, they're not the <laughs> smartest group. So. Yeah. So yeah. he's. They're all. They're both basically crying about it and everything. Yeah. And Thanos is like, "You're not gonna do it. I'm like, do it. Come on. Do it. Wuss. Come on. Let's go. Do it." I dare you. Yeah. I dare you. Kill my daughter. <laughs> yeah. And so he finally does eventually shoot at her. But by that time, Turned Thanos is bubbles. like... Yeah. Thanos is like, I'm going to stop anything <laughs> that we do. not going to let this happen. I have this stupid reality stone. I mean, mm-hmm. come on. So yeah, he turns it into bubbles. Yep. And then he leaves with Gamora. Yep. Portal's on out of there. Yep. So then we have Rhodey. He's talking to... Old Thunderbolt yep, Ross. Thunderbolt Ross and some other people. Yeah. And they're talking about how... What are they talking about? <laughs> <laughs> uh, I mean, they're talking about how, like, they've got the plane full of criminals that need that, to be yeah. taken care yeah, of. Yeah, exactly. And all that. He's like, Rody, I'm going to yeah. leave you to take care of all that, mm-hmm. arrest them. 
Because they show yeah. up. He's like, I'll get right on that. The old Ross there. Yep. And even Captain America told him, like, hey, we're going to fight these people. And if you get in the way, we're going to fight you too. So yep. maybe you should just stay out of it. And they do. <laughs> Thank yeah. goodness. So. But um, as soon as as soon as Thunderbolt Ross is like uh, arrest those people, Rhodey's like, "Yeah, we'll do." And then yeah. he he's like flicks them off yep. the screen. <laughs> yeah, <laughs> and then he's like, "Well, that's a court martial." <laughs> yeah, because <laughs> he's not gonna do it. He's not gonna arrest these. Yeah, people. he's got his supportive force gun, but legs on. They were you mean by. Lieutenant Dan? No, remember? Oh yeah, oh yeah, he did supports. have those. I was thinking of Lieutenant Dan because he's got his. Little titanium yeah. legs at the end. Yeah. They were my magic shoes. <laughs> yep. <laughs> Mama said that. <laughs> 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 Mama said they'd take me anywhere. anywhere. <laughs> if we ever do Forrest Gump, we're just going to do Forrest Gump voice the whole yeah. time. Yeah. I just know it. Rhodey, surprisingly okay seeing Vision, the guy who crippled him. <laughs> <laughs> I forgot about that. Oh my God, it was No him. hard feelings there. I totally forgot. And Falcon, the guy who was also partially responsible for it. Oh my gosh. So, yeah. Because was Falcon the one that he was trying to shoot down? Yes. Yeah, that Vision so, was trying to shoot down and he shot Rhodey yeah. instead. Yeah. Yeah. You know, it's all it's all Water past. under the bridge. <laughs> who's, who's mad? It's been years now. Yeah. He's like, we got to find a way to save yeah. Vision. <laughs> Bruce comes out. He's like, hey, I'm here too, guys. Yep. Bye. Nat. Yep. They were in love. Yep. But anyway, they're like, what are we going to do? Vision's mm-hmm. hurt. And we've and they're coming for the stone. Mm-hmm. We've got to figure out a way to gotta get it out of his head. Get the stone out. Because they're like, maybe if something with similar power, mm-hmm. or power that came from the same thing, can destroy yeah. it also. And of course, that's where Wanda's powers came from, was from the yeah. stone. So like, maybe Wanda can do it. But if she does it, it's going to sacrifice Vision. It's going to kill Vision. Mm-hmm. Vision's like, yeah, that's cool. That's fine. And the guy's like, no, we don't do that, bro. We don't trade lives. Exactly. Which I feel like they have. Uh, yeah, probably. <laughs> Whatever. Um, so, but this time they don't want to do that. Yeah. <laughs> so they're it was like, like, there might be a way to get rid of it because you're not just the stone. You have yes. Tony and Tony and Bruce, Bruce and, and Jarvis. Jarvis and, and Ultron. Ultron. And, yeah. It's not, it's all connected and to Stan the stone. Lee's in there. Yeah. I was trying to think of the other guy. Well, Stan Lee and... Jack Kirby. Yeah. Oh, okay. I don't know if he was... I don't know who created yeah, Vision, honestly. Know. It probably was them, but... I don't know. Maybe Chip um, Zdarsky. Who knows? <laughs> but, uh, yeah, so they're like, it's it's not all just the stone. There are other parts of you. And maybe yeah. if we can find a way to get the stone out without messing all that up, then you can still be Vision. Still be Vision. And you just won't have the Mind Stone. Mm-hmm. And then we can destroy the stone. He won't be able to get it. Everything will be wins. great. But we can't do it here. Nope. Um, and Steve's like, I know a guy. He's like, I know the best place to go Let's to do this. Let's go. Then we move over to Cut Wakanda. To Wakanda. Yeah. Early evening. <laughs> <laughs> Midwinter. Uh, <laughs> it's not. It's I don't know some, where this is. Probably in the summer. Um, Seems hot. Yeah, but we have we have T'Challa and Okoye. They're mm-hmm. walking around. Mm-hmm. They're like, oh, the border border people are still. Mm-hmm. There's still some of them left, just in case y'all wanted to know if we killed them all. <laughs> Since they were dirty in the, traitors in, in the, the last, last movie, movie you yeah. saw. Uh, just wanted to cover that right quick. <laughs> yeah, just want you to let everybody know that there are still some of them around. Hope you're not expecting to see that freaking traitor, whatever his name so, yeah, was. We don't... Uh, Wadi, I don't know what his name is. Oh my god, I can't remember his name. I don't, I don't care, he's a dirty traitor. I said it so many times last episode, and then it just, <laughs> just completely left my my mind daniel kaluuya yeah anyway if you're if you're expecting to see him don't <laughs> yeah he gone which we we stood up and cheered <laughs> it's wakabi wakabi yeah i was like i know it sounds like something else i always think of wasabi yeah. <laughs> but it's wakabi <laughs> so they walk down and they have this the lone wolf or white wolf. white wolf white wolf they have this package with them this mm-hmm. like suitcase kind of thing yeah. they open it up they're like we got you a new arm here you go i can't believe they didn't give him a new arm before this yeah but i mean i guess maybe they didn't want to give him a new arm because they were probably still trying to like <laughs> hello are you rebooting <laughs> <laughs> what are you trying to say? He's brainwashed. Yeah, they, they're trying to like oh, de-brainwash him or whatever. Okay. <laughs> okay. I find it blank. 
I mean, they, I feel like they still could have given him just a regular prosthetic arm or something. Yeah, yeah, they probably could have. <laughs> like, you don't have to give him a weaponized arm. <laughs> exactly. The dude's just doing everything with one arm when y'all have the technology to help him out. That's true. Maybe yeah. they just wanted his other arm to really be buff, you know? I guess. We just can't make it buff enough. <laughs> we just need him buffer, okay? I refuse to give him an arm until it is buff enough. <laughs> Are you buff enough? <laughs> oh man! So yeah, they bring his new arm to him. Yeah, and he's like, "All right, who are, who are we fighting?" Yeah, where's the war? Where's the war? It's, like, yep. it's coming to us. It's on its way. Yep. So then we go to the spaceship, Ebony Maw's spaceship. Mm. He's got uh, Doctor Strange. He's like floating. He's got yeah. n- little needles, spikes like, around him. Yeah, yeah. Pointing all at him. Yeah. It's like the worst acupuncture. Yeah. They're used for microsurgery yeah. or something usually. Some of them are pointing like directly at his eyes. I'm like, yeah, I don't like that. It's rough go. <laughs> no. <laughs> no, they, thank you. They like poke into him and like they have like energy. I don't know yeah. what they're doing exactly. I don't know. But they're um, not good. No. And he's, he's still trying to get that stone, of course. Mm-hmm. And... Uh, uh, Dr. He's Strange, like, if I get back, not... if I get back there to Thanos without that yeah. stone, uh, it's going to be trouble for everybody. Yeah. So. Strange is not giving it up, though. He's like, nope. nope, ain't happening. Nope. So then Tony's there. He's watching all this. Mm-hmm. And Peter shows up. <laughs> yeah. And the cape. <laughs> yeah. Everybody's yeah. The cape there. shows up first and kind of like taps him on the shoulder. Yeah. He's like, oh, OK, good to see you here. And then <laughs> Peter shows up and he's like, <laughs> What are you doing here? I sent you back to Earth. He's, He's like, like no. no, dude, this suit's really intuitive. And yeah. I just wanted to grab on and I did. Yeah. Like, We've so. got to figure out a way to get rid of this guy. Yeah. And so Peter's, Peter's got a like, plan. He was like, have you ever seen the movie Alien? This really old, <laughs> old movie, movie called yeah. Aliens. <laughs> yeah. Oh, man. Yeah, there are a lot of little references like that. Yeah, really he's cute. always like calling it's like, back wow, stuff. Wow, this is just like this not movie. Not that you know? old to us, but <laughs> yeah. damn. Yeah. Man. It's so funny. So Tony causes a distraction mm-hmm. and he's like, oh, the kid has good pop culture movies. Yeah. Knowledge. So he just shoots the wall of the yep. spaceship, sucks out of any mall. Yep. Almost looks out strange. Uh-huh. I mean, kind of does. It does, but uh, Peter Spider-Man grabs him, grabs him and pulls yeah. him back in. Uh, Tony seals the ship back up, and Ebony yeah. Maw just like he's just floating, he's out, just there. floating out there, like, <laughs> with his, with his like a, when you kill a bug and it like curls up and uh, on mm-hmm. the ground. That's about what it was like. You know what it made me think of? What a nice little uh, episode throwback to when we watched House on the Haunted Hill and the old black <laughs> lady, lady that like. <laughs> <laughs> that just went just, across the floor. Yeah, like basically skateboards across yeah. the floor because she's literally just she's not yeah. moving her legs. They're just like yeah. she's like got her hands on yeah. like that. <laughs> That's what it looked that like. That was great. Yeah. <laughs> Miss that oh, lady. Man. That's great. And it's like she was just. <laughs> It was just like the, so weird. The blind housekeeper or something. Yeah. It was like <laughs> nothing. What? Yeah. So such a weird movie. I yeah, love it though. I still it was, love it. It was weird. And then the girl screaming, of course. Yeah. That real high pitched annoying scream. Anyway, so he's gone. <laughs> yeah. They say Doctor Strange. Mm-hmm. Doctor Strange's like, we gotta get this out of here. Tony's like, hear me out. Let's go to Thanos. Yeah. And beat him up. Mm-hmm. And he's like, you want to take the stone to Thanos. Yeah. But their reasoning is, like, I don't know, that he they can catch him unaware and without all his people and everything. Yeah. So, I guess. I guess so. Anyway, it's also at this point that Doctor Strange and Peter Parker meet for the first time. Yeah. <laughs> and Peter introduces himself yeah. as Peter Parker. Hi, I'm Peter course. Parker. Hi, I'm Peter Parker. And Doctor Strange is like, I'm Doctor Strange. Yeah. And he's like, oh, we're using our made-up names. I'm <laughs> Spider-Man. <laughs> Yeah. He's still like, no, I'm Dr. Strange. <laughs> oh, man. It's, Peter is so cute in this. He is great. He just looks he like... so good He's just this. this little tiny little boy. He's yeah. just so cute. <laughs> yep. Just... Just love him. <laughs> yep. In the middle of it all. Oh. <laughs> oh, man. So, uh, yeah. Tony does convince him to go ahead and head off, you know, keep going on to Titan. Mm-hmm. And Dr. Strange is like, all right, well, I just want you to know that if... It comes down to you or the kid mm-hmm. and or the, stone. or the stone. Choosing that stone, Choosing baby. the stone. That stone is going to be my first priority. Yep. I don't know you two. I don't yep. care if you die. <laughs> yeah. Sorry about y'all. <laughs> yep. So there we go. They're mm-hmm. heading to Titan. Then we have Gamora and Thanos. They're 
around Thanos' ship. Mm-hmm. They're in, like, the throne room or whatever. Yeah. She hates that throne. Yep. She throws soup at it. Yep. <laughs> <laughs> Although, nothing splashes out of that bowl. Yeah, um, we don't I know what it was. Empty. I think it was a real a real coffee cup situation. <laughs> Could where be, yeah. There was nothing in there. Yeah, um, probably. So, anyway, but she does throw it at it. She's like, mm-hmm. I hate this. I hate, hate everything. everything. <laughs> I hate this life. That's why I left. You suck. Yeah. You suck. You're the worst. Yeah. And he starts talking about how, you know, the universe has finite resources mm-hmm. and all this stuff. And we have to. Tells her that her people are flourishing now mm-hmm. and it's a utopia. Because they have enough to eat and yep. everything. And that's what he wants to do for the universe. Yep. The whole universe. It's like, okay. And then he takes her to where he is torturing Nebula. Mm-hmm. Because, of course, Gamora's like, or he says, you know, I sent you to find the soul stone. And, and all I got was this lousy t-shirt. Yeah. And you came back and said you didn't find it, but I know you're lying. Lying. You're very bad at lying. Because I never taught you to lie. If I had taught Mm -hmm. you to lie, you'd be good at it. Yeah. (laughs) It's like, okay. Yeah. Okay. He he took credit for a lot of stuff. I don't know. He said you're strong. Okay, Mm -hmm. that's fine. And like, you're kind or merciful or something. Something like that. And it's like, "Mm, I don't think you taught her that. No. I'm going to say no Mm -hmm. on that one. Uh, So, yeah. yeah. But he's torturing Nebula. Yeah. And he went back into Nebula's memories and mm-hmm. found a memory where they were talking to each other that or Nebula and Gamora were talking yeah. to each other about her search for the soul stone and that she had found it. Yeah, she had found the map. Or the map to it. She yeah. burned it. Yeah. So that he would never get to it. Exactly. But so yep, she does know where the location is. Yep. So he just keeps on torturing Nebula. Yep. And Gamora, who was willing to sacrifice her own life earlier, knew the consequences of mm-hmm. him getting this is like oh, please don't hurt my sister yeah talk yeah here i'll tell you where it is it's on vormir yeah i mean when it's her own life she doesn't care yeah but way to go gamora yeah <laughs> you screwed it oh also way to go peter quill for not shooting her in the first place even yeah. though he promised he would yeah i um, mean he tried at least he did but, but it, took it took forever a long time if yeah. he had just did it as soon as he got her yeah maybe this would have stopped everything but you know whatever there's a lot of blame to go around here. <laughs> oh my god, there's so much blame. <laughs> oh jeez. But we so. will not blame Doctor Strange and the portals. We can all agree on this now. <laughs> <laughs> oh goodness. All right. So it's on Vormir. Yes, Vormir mm-hmm. it is. Vormir from Lord of the Rings. Mm-hmm. Elrond's there. <laughs> Elrond. Technically, that's technically not Elrond. Technically not. But <laughs> artist formerly known as Elrond. <laughs> But we're not going there yet because we have to go to other places first. Yep. In our magic shoes. (laughs) What? In our magic shoes. Stop. (laughs) Mom said that take me anywhere. (laughs) Oh, man. No, we we catch up with uh, Thor and Groot and Rocket. Yep. Groot says he's got to pee, apparently. Oh, yeah. He's talking about how he has to pee. Yeah. But he's talking in Groot, of course. Mm-hmm. And Rocket starts talking back to him. And then Thor also starts talking yeah. back to him. Because Thor knows, knows Groot. Groot yeah. Because Groot was an elective in, <laughs> on Asgard. Yeah. So that's kind of fun. Yeah. Thor starts talking about... He's lost he's everything. He's lost everything, basically. Yeah. His mother... Well, first, his mother's the last one he talks about. Because mm-hmm. he's like... He lost his, his dad, his sister. Because he had to kill his sister. <laughs> he lost mm-hmm. his brother. And, of course, Rocket's like, well, you still have a mom, right? He's like, nope. <laughs> nope, she did. <laughs> She's gone, too. My yep. best friend's dead. My best friend's dead. Stabbed to the heart. <laughs> Everybody, yep. Everybody's dead. Everybody around you is dying. Yeah. So, not looking good for poor Thor. Yeah. He's got to do this. Yeah. Got nothing left to lose. Exactly. And um, Rocket gives him an eye. He does. He's he stole like, off somebody. Like a, mm-hmm. Of course, because he's always stealing body parts. Yep. So he gives him that eye. Mm-hmm. And he immediately puts it in. He's like, oh, I mm, should have watched that first. Yeah. I had to <laughs> smuggle that. So. Yep. Um, but then just then they arrive at the place. Need a Valir. Yep. Um, it is a star. He needed an eye, not a. I'm needing you to get out. <laughs> So, yeah, it's a star, but it has gone out. Yep. And Something's wrong. The rings around it are frozen. Yep. So, they head inside to the forge. Mm-hmm. Um, it's supposed to have, like, a bunch of dwarves there. Yep. But where are the dwarves? They're gone. There's one dwarf left, though. Etri. This is mm-hmm. Peter Dinklage. Yep. And... Big Peter Dinklage. He's big Peter Dinklage. Yep. He's much bigger than everybody else. Yeah. 
Because I guess their dwarves are... He's a big dwarf. Large. Yep. He's the only one left, though. Thanos showed up, made them make the gauntlet. Yeah, made him. He said he'd kill everybody else. Yeah, he's, he's like, like, if you don't if you don't make this for me, I'll kill everybody. So he's like, all right. He made it. And he killed everybody. And then he killed anybody. everybody. Wait. Anybody, anybody, anybody. Everybody, everybody. He killed everybody That's anyway. All, so it was like it was like 300 dwarves that were there. Yeah. And they're all dead now. Except mm. for him. He's the only one that lived. And he's lived. like, your hands are for me alone. Yeah. And he stoned him up. Yeah. She can still use him pretty much. So Yeah. He's fine. Yeah, Man, he's how long has it been since he ate something? Yeah, I don't know. I don't know. Not that there's really anything to eat on there. I don't know That's what true. they're eating in the That's first true. place. So they're like, well, we got to figure out a way to get this forge going again. Mm-hmm. Then we move back to somebody else. There's a lot of moving around. Yep. Nebula is being put back together, basically. Yep. She escapes. Yep. She sends a message to Mantis. Mm-hmm. She's like, meet me on Titan. Yep. That's a good, that's a good Nebula. <laughs> that, you, that is not the first time you've told me that's a good yeah. Nebula. <laughs> it seems like every Guardians movie we do, I do Nebula, yeah. and you're like, that's good Nebula. That's good. That's good. <laughs> Thank you. <laughs> there you are. Where was that? <laughs> On Titan, mm-hmm. Tony and everybody the crash, crash land crash yeah. land there because uh, they don't know how to fly this ship <laughs> yeah it's for a know. really big person yeah so it crash lands they're all fine but somebody comes into the uh into the ship mm. it's the guardians yep. <laughs> they're there they're they've made there. it there they have they're, a big fight yeah they think it's thanos yep they're like they're you're at work- least working for yep. him yep. they're like you're working for thanos and he's like no we're not no, <laughs> what are you talking about like, you're working we for thanos, thanos. Like, no. Uh, so yeah, um, this is where we also get the, where is Gamora? Yeah. Who is Gamora? <laughs> why is Gamora? Yeah. Because of course Drax has to <laughs> throw out a, why is yeah. Gamora? Yeah, Drax is good in this movie. He's good, yep. So once they realize that they're all allies, because mm-hmm. of course Spider-Man's like, we're the Avengers. Yeah. Uh, which uh, Peter has been Peter has that. been officially uh, accepted as one of the Avengers because Tony's like you're yes. an Avenger now, kid, <laughs> <Yeah>. <laughs> basically. Uh, but yeah, Thor had told them that the Avengers on Earth were he was part of the team. The mightiest heroes, yep. yeah. So they're like, "Oh, you're the Avengers? Uh, yeah, we heard about you from Thor." And they're like, uh-huh. "Thor, you've seen Thor?" And it's like, "Yep, uh, ugly guy." Yeah, <laughs> yeah. <laughs> Peter. Yeah. yeah. <laughs> So, yeah, they know Thor. Uh, so they can all work together now. Mm-hmm. Thor, of course, is getting ready to help build Stormbreaker. Yep. Which is going to be his new axe. Legendary weapon mm-hmm. that is said to be able to summon the Bifrost. Yes. There's a lot of moving back and forth. Because now we go back to Titan. <laughs> <laughs> Where Tony and Star-Lord are trying to make a plan. Yeah, the Guardians don't listen. They're just doing their own thing. Yeah. They're not good with plans. No. And they're like, guys... Seriously, he's going to kill us <laughs> yeah, all. Yeah, we've got to figure something out. He's very strong. Uh, Peter, of course, is like... Uh, Peter Quill. Because mm-hmm. there are two Peters there at this point Peters, now. There are two Peters, yes. Uh, Peter Quill is just like, yeah, I'm going to come up with a plan because I'm good at this. <laughs> yeah, I'm going to improvise. <laughs> and then, of course, uh, Drax says something about the um, the dance-off. Mm-hmm. And Spider-Man is like, oh, like in like Footloose? In Footloose? Yeah. And Peter Quill, of course, is just like, yeah, yeah j- just like Footloose. It's still the greatest movie ever made. Yeah. And be- no. <laughs> that, it never was. <laughs> oh, man. So but While they're talking, Doctor Strange is over there. Yeah. Spazzing out. Yeah, because Mantis is like, does your friend always do that? <laughs> yeah. <laughs> yeah, he's seeing, he's looking at all possible outcomes, mm-hmm. basically. He looked at 14,605 outcomes. Yeah. And, he's, and Tony's like, like how, well, how many of them did we win? He's like, one. Yeah. <laughs> it's like, oh, no. Not good odds. No, terrible odds. Never tell me the odds. Yeah. Then we... Move over to Thanos and Gamora. They've uh-huh. arrived on Vormir. Uh-huh. They start walking up the mountainside. They run into Red Skull, who is yeah. there. So yeah, when he touched the Tesseract, basically it sent him there, and now he yeah. has to guard the the stone, the, the soul, soul stone. stone. Yeah. Who was there before? <laughs> I wonder. Who knows. <laughs> Oh, man. So, yeah, they get up there. He tells them that the stone demands a sacrifice. Mm -hmm. A soul for a soul. Yep. You have to lose that which you love the most. Yeah. And Gamora just laughs because she's like, you don't love anything. You don't love anything. (laughs) And he turns around. He's like, she's like, are you crying? Are you seriously (laughs) crying right now? Yeah. He's like, they're not. uh, Red Skull's like, those tears aren't for him. him. Yep. Because apparently he does love Gamora. Yeah. She's like, no, this is. This is. Not love. You're creepy. Yeah. <laughs> and weird. Which he is. Yeah. He's 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 very he's the mad type. Yeah. He's insane. Yep. So he takes her and he throws her off yep. the cliff. 
Mm-hmm. She falls to her death, and there goes Gamora. She's gone. Yep. And he wakes up in a pool, and he's got the soul stone. Yep. Yay. <laughs> Cool. He did it. Good for him. <laughs> uh, so then we go to Wakanda. Mm-hmm. Shuri is there. Uh, she's going to try to get the stone from Vision. Yeah. She's like, why didn't you do it this other way? It would have yeah. made more sense and it would have all been separate. And, they're, yeah. and Bruce is like, we didn't think about it. Yeah. <laughs> she's like, oh, idiots. <laughs> so it's going to take a lot. They got to like disconnect trillions of neurons. Yeah. It's going to so take a long time. It's going to take a long time. So she uh, gets to work, and of course, that's when things start attacking. Yep, ships start arriving, yep. landing. They tried to land straight on Wakanda, yeah, but, but there's it, a force they, field. There's a dome shield that's <laughs> over the whole city, so they just hit it. And, yeah, it explodes yep. everywhere. So they can't get in that way, but they, they have a big army that just kind of sh- starts showing up outside of yeah, the shield. Yeah, well, uh, Cole Obsidian and uh, mm-hmm. Proxima Midnight come up to the barrier first and talk to Cap and... Black Panther and someone else, maybe Black Widow. They're like, "Hey, where's your, where's your, where's your boy?" And mm-hmm. he's like, "You'll pay for his life." And we've got an army. Yeah. <laughs> and yeah, that's when all the little, I don't know, are they supposed to be Chitauris or I little guess demon so. guys? I don't know what they are. I don't know. But yeah, they're all running around. They're crazy. Mm-hmm. They're throwing themselves at the shield. Yep. Meanwhile, uh, Rocket and Thor are trying to get the forge restarted. Mm-hmm. So that he attaches himself to the ro- to the sh- to Rocket's ship and mm-hmm. like flings it around in a circle yes. and then throws him and they turn on the engine and he starts going and Thor's yep. able to grab a hold onto the thing and get it started. Yeah, so it gets started. Everything seems to be going fine at first and then something breaks like the, the iris the iris breaks or yeah. whatever and it's not going to hold open by itself. So it closes and they're like Dang, we're going to have to figure out another way to do this. Yep, something needs to hold it open. Yep. Good so, news, I'm Thor. Okay. <laughs> um, back on back in Wakanda, though, they are realizing that the bad guys are starting to like go around mm-hmm. the shield a little bit, like toward the back of the shield, and that's closer to where Vision is, and there's nobody yeah. back there guarding it. So if they get through, they're going to be able to get to Vision. They're so, going to flank them, yeah. So they have to open part of the barrier, so um, they'll come. Just funnels them in straight funnel to one area instead of going around. Mm-hmm. So they're doing that. And then Thor, he goes out. He's like, I'm going to open that iris mm-hmm. and get this thing started. Get it at least going long enough so that we can get this stuff melted and you can make the uh t- make stormbreaker yep so he manually like, opens it up he's like it, 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 that's gonna kill you it's the force of a star yeah, yeah. <laughs> it's <laughs> burning you and so he's like i forget what he says i don't know like, <laughs> he I, says something and it's like that's what killing oh yeah means, it's like <laughs> yeah he's like it'll kill you and he's like only if i die first yeah so he's and like, that's he's like that's what killing, killing me means <laughs> Yeah. So stupid. So. But he goes out there and he opens it up. It starts the forge. Mm-hmm. Um, Melts he, the stuff. Mm-hmm, he somehow survives it, but he's not doing well. Yeah, he's, Rocket, he falls down. Yeah, he's hurting. Rocket brings him back in, I think. Yeah. And, of course, the uh, Stormbreaker is ready, but it needs... A handle. Mm-hmm. Each we can't find the handle. So Groot just takes his arm and he puts it together makes and makes a handle out of his arm. arm. Yeah. Um, and then now that it's completed and Thor is about to die, basically, mm-hmm. but it goes to his hand. Yeah. And it can, and it okay. can revive him, basically. Yep. So, yay. Good job. Uh, things are looking bleak in Wakanda. Yep. Uh, Bruce is in the Hulkbuster armor, and mm-hmm. every time he takes that helmet off, just the worst CGI. Just so... <laughs> The proportion is just so bad. It looks so ridiculous. I hate that. I hate it so much. It's like the only thing I really hate about this movie is that mm. right there. So, but yeah, everybody's getting beat up. Mm-hmm. It's not going well. Yep. But good news. Here comes Thor. Yep. He's here. He's around. He rainbow bridges in. Yep. And of course, Groot and Rocket are also with him. Mm-hmm. And he just starts going crazy on that yep. battlefield. Goes full just Thor power. Lightning everywhere. Yep. Uh, Meanwhile, Thanos arrives on Titan. He's there now. He thinks that the universe will be grateful that he's doing all this. Mm Because he's talking to Doctor Strange. Because Doctor Strange is there by himself. 
Everybody yeah. else is hiding, of course. And it's like it, only somebody with a will as strong as mine can do this. Mm-hmm. And Doctor Strange's like, well, I think you'll find our will is equally as He's strong. He's like, our will. <laughs> and everybody comes out. Yeah, tell Tony him. brings a like a big rock <laughs> right down on him. Yeah, yeah, doesn't and do much. Peter's like, well, you pissed him off. Good job. <laughs> Quill, Peter Quill says that. Yes, he does. Uh, yeah, so uh, Doctor Strange tells him, you know, don't let him close his fist. Because mm-hmm. if he closes his fist, that's when he can use those stones. Yeah. So if they keep his fist open, it should be fine. Yeah. I mean, he's still very powerful. Very strong. But yes. it's better to fight him in his normal state than with all the stones that he has. Yep. So. They fight a lot. They fight a lot. Yep. And, I mean, there's just like fighting all over. And then they, mm-hmm. they are trying to get the gauntlet off. Of his yeah, hand. I'm gonna take his gauntlet off. <laughs> um, so yeah, they're trying to get that gauntlet. Yeah, they've got him all tied up mm-hmm. and such. Like Mantis is trying to put him to sleep. Yep, and but he's very strong. She's yes. having a tough time. Yeah. And he's also in mourning. <laughs> yep. And Spider Man and Iron Man are pulling on the mm-hmm. gauntlet. I think Drax is too. Probably. Everybody's trying to get it off of him. Yep. Peter um, Quill saunters up. Oh, also Nebula has shown up at this point too. Oh, yeah. She came in on her ship. And she did. She just ran him over. <laughs> yeah. Yeah. Just, <laughs> that was great. Yeah. So she's there also. Yeah. And then, yeah, Quill, Peter Quill shows up. He's yeah. Like, Where's Gamora? Yeah. Where is she? Where is she? Yeah. And of course, he's. Not really saying exactly, yeah. But by the context clues, Nebula yeah. realizes what has happened, yeah. Because he, he went to Vormir with Gamora, and he came back with the stone. Mm-hmm. And Gamora's not there anymore, so something bad happened on yep. Vormir. Uh, so Peter's not very happy. Yeah, he's like, "Tell this. me you didn't kill her." Exactly. Lie to me. <sighs> I, oh my god. And then, yeah. They're Everybody's so like, close. shut up, Pete. Just chill. Just leave it. Just chill. Just let it. us get this gauntlet off yeah. of his hand. And it's then like almost can do off. It's almost it's- off. It actually comes off yeah. at the very end yeah. right there. Because Peter has it, but uh-huh. he grabs it back yeah. immediately. But he course. starts punching at his head, which Mantis is holding. <laughs> yeah. So he's like punching her hand specifically. And so, of course, she loses control. Of course. And everything. It's like you couldn't have waited like five more seconds. <laughs> but if I may argue this. Okay. Guess who wasn't saying anything? Stephen Strange. Why? He's seen this. Mm, true. He knows Peter Quill's got to be a dumbass. <laughs> it's our only chance. Our so only he's hope. Like, Come on, Pete. You can do it. Hit Manus's hands. He, he's sitting go. over there going, yes. <laughs> yeah, yes. He's going to do it. And then it's all going to plan. Yeah. So this was perfect. I mean, it was the plan. So Pete, Pete did exactly what he needed to do. Yeah. So he's the hero, actually, of this movie. I'm not going to say that. <laughs> I'm not going to say <laughs> If they had taken it off, everything would have gone all, all crazy. So let's, let's, all, let's all take a moment to thank Star-Lord today. <laughs> if they had taken it off and defeated Thanos some how there were only like two more stones left Mm -hmm. somebody one of these people that is with that they're with drags probably would have been like maybe he had something (laughs) maybe he had the right idea (laughs) no no (laughs) No, he would i think he would have just gotten it back from him probably he probably would have very strong somehow ended up killing them all yeah and i don't think they're powerful enough to use those stones yeah because it kills somebody later on, eventually, True. you know. And so. almost kills somebody else. Yeah. So, <sighs> I'm telling yeah. you, it's God's plan. <laughs> okay. <laughs> this is the strangest plan. Yeah. So, anyway, yep, he gets out. He still has the... And maybe that's also why Doctor Strange wasn't like, here's a portal, let him put his hand in it and we'll cut it off. Because it's not supposed to happen like that. Doctor Strange knows. So lay off everybody. He's seen it all. Can I continue? <sighs> no. I just want everybody to chill a little about this. <laughs> I'm going to tell you, until today, I had never even heard that theory, well, so... <laughs> welcome to the world. Okay. All right. What's happening next? Are, are you I'm done, yes. Okay. Okay. So, he's, he gets... They almost have it off. Mm-hmm. But, of course, he wakes up. He grabs it again. Yeah. It's back on. Is this when he pulls the moon toward him? Maybe. I don't remember. Everybody goes flying. Yeah. So, I, I can't remember. I think that probably is probably. when it happens. I'm not really sure. And then they cut away to... Yeah. I think Wakanda. They go back to Wakanda. This is when the, maybe the rollers are coming under the underground. Yes. The rollers Drillers go, thing. Yeah. They go under the shield. Yeah. And come up into the battlefield. 
Which, you know, not a great shield if you can go under it. Go under it, it. exactly. Yeah. Who, some, I guess that may be how Claw stole everything. He probably just dug a hole like Bugs Bunny and just stealing everything. <laughs> he Shawshank redemptioned himself. <laughs> yeah, pretty much. So, yeah, it, they come up into the battlefield. Mm-hmm. They're all almost running over everybody. The big saw wheels, basically. Mm-hmm. And, of course, um, and of course, Wanda sees this mm-hmm. from the lab and she's like, I've got to do something about it. So she leaves the lab yeah. where she's supposed to be helping Smart protect kid. everything. Yep. And uh, she gets rid of the things. Yeah. And of course, once they see that she's out on the field. Yeah. Uh, Proxima Midnight is like, all right, she's out here. Yeah. Do your thing. <gasps> what? Corvus Glaive He was not alive the whole dead? time. Raven pull arms back. What? Yes. What? So How? he starts killing everybody. Yep. In Wakanda. In the lab. Yep. Vision has Shuri to like. Shuri fights him. Yeah, Shuri fights him. Vision has to like fly away, I guess. Yeah. So yeah, all of that's happening. <laughs> yep. So yep, things are looking even worse in Wakanda. Yep, not doing good. <laughs> Proxima Midnight starts fighting against Wanda, mm-hmm. has her down, but then, of course, Black, Black Widow, Widow and... and Okoye show up. Yeah. They're ready to fight her. Mm-hmm. Like, she's not alone. Yeah. So they start fighting and everything. And then Wanda throws her into a saw wheel. Yep. And she she's dead. gone. <laughs> yep. And I was like, good riddance. <laughs> Um, Cole Obsidian gets attached to something. Yeah, some, some flying thing. Yeah, and he flies up into the, uh, the shield. into the shield. He's drug and, along it. Yeah, and explodes, basically. Yeah, he did. Corvus Glaive starts fighting. He goes after Vision and starts mm-hmm. fighting him, which I think that may be a little bit later, but I can't remember. There's a lot of stuff uh, that happens all at once. There's a lot of stuff once. going on, yeah. It may be around here. So, yeah, he starts fighting Vision. Cap shows up, maybe. I, I can't remember who comes up, but they they, they all fight him. Mm-hmm. And then Vision stabs him with his own Yep. His own, own weapon. Blade. Yeah. So he's gone. So all the bad guys there are gone. Yeah. Well, all of the generals or yeah, whatever. Except the minions. Yep. So they still have those like guys. The they're fighting. Minions. Yeah. <laughs> I wish. Dave. They he's were there. Kevin. Kevin. <laughs> I don't know their I don't know their names. I think that's I think that's two of their names. I, don't I think so too. Them. Ed. I don't yeah. Know. <laughs> <laughs> Man, I, don't know. I think that was a that was a hyena. <laughs> there is a hyena named yeah, Ed. Yeah. The yeah. King, yeah. yeah, yeah, there is. Because <laughs> he's the dumb one. <laughs> So yeah, back on Titan yes. though. Doctor Strange goes full Doctor Strange, where he pulls Mystic Art stuff going on. Mm-hmm. He's got Mirror Dimension stuff happening. He's got multiple Stranges, yep. all kinds of stuff, but uh, it doesn't really work. <laughs> Meanwhile, Spider Man is like trying to save people who yeah, are flying he's just in the grabbing air, grabbing people out of the air. <laughs> yep. Yeah. Um, Tony comes up, starts fighting him. Yeah, he starts fighting Thanos. Yeah. He's trying his best. It's not it's not going going well. very well. He does manage to scratch his cheek though yeah. and he's like all that for a drop of blood yeah a little purple blood <laughs> grimace, grimace action yeah he does get called grimace at one yeah, point as he should mm-hmm. and then um, he just beats the crap out of Tony and eventually just stabs, stabs him, him with his own blade from yeah. his suit yep so Tony's been stabbed I thought they were, they were killing Iron Man right I did there. too I was like Tony is dead oh no yeah <laughs> I'm like they're killing Tony Stark yep <laughs> really <laughs> then Doctor Strange like spare him. Yep, yeah, spare his spare life. Spare my I'll, baby. Spare his life, and I'll give you the stone, which is yeah. exactly what he said he wasn't gonna do. Uh huh. But he knows something. That was before he saw the exactly. stuff. Yeah, exactly. So he's like, I'll give you the stone, and so he does. Mm-hmm. He takes that stone and he puts it in the gauntlet, and he pieces out. Pieces out. <laughs> yep. He's Tony gone. freezes his wound shut, basically. Yep. Yep, and Peter Quill shows up at the last minute to yeah. like right as he's like leaving. He's like, "Did we just lose?" Yeah, I'm like, "Buddy, yeah, yeah you, lost you did, <laughs> you did." Yep, or did they? <sighs> Overall. <laughs> well, I mean, they do lose, but, you know, they can come back from In it. In the grand scheme, they, they lost the battle. Yes, they did not lose the war. Yes. Yet. Yet. <laughs> so, so everybody's... He, oh, so Tony looks at Doctor Strange, mm-hmm. and Doctor Strange is like, we're in the end game now. We're in the end game now, dog. There you go. I knew you were going to do that. <laughs> I knew it. As soon as I started saying we're in the end game now, I was like, he's going to do it. He's going to do it. I just know it. <laughs> you just ripped a plan out of the ground out of anger. <laughs> <laughs> what are you talking about? I did not. She just grabbed her mouth plant. 
threw it across the... <laughs> there was a piece of fuzz on it. I was trying to get fuzz off. Fuzz off, man. So, yeah. Back um, to Wakanda. Yep. Thanos arrives. Mm-hmm. Uh-oh. Vision can feel it. Mm-hmm. In his stones. Yep. His... <laughs> In his stone, mm-hmm. in the mind stone, it starts yep. vibrating Buzzing. or whatever. Yeah. <laughs> and he's like, Wanda, you gotta kill you me. You gotta do it. There's, do it. It's the only way. Do it now. You have to, you have to destroy the stone. Mm-hmm. All yeah, the other wanna. people, all the other people show up, mm-hmm. you know, they're fighting Thanos, trying yeah. to keep him from getting to the stone. Yeah, he's just beating them all. Everybody's there. Mm-hmm. Almost. Everybody's there. <laughs> yeah. There's one person. Yeah. One significant member of this uh-huh. group who is not there. Yeah. Not helping out. It's true. Where was he? <laughs> yeah. Yeah. We don't know. Anyway, so she does end up destroying it. Yep. And I will say, they are, they kind of foreshadow Cat being just super powerful because he's able mm-hmm. to like he's the hold only the one gauntlet, who's, yeah, and yeah, like stop him from hitting him, basically. Yeah. And yeah, so Cap's, for a for a while, Cap is very strong. He is. He's such a strong guy. He's a strong he's, boy. Yeah. <laughs> okay. But yeah, he, he gets punched by the other fist. He does. <laughs> <laughs> Unfortunately. But yeah, um, yes. just as Thanos is coming up to him, she does destroy the stone. Yeah. Kills vision explodes everywhere yep. and rough go yep then it's like oh that's cute that's cute I but guess what stone. i have <laughs> exactly so he uses the time stone he reverses it all he yep. resets it and then he takes the stone yep and kills just vision rips it out just of his rips head. it straight out of his head yep rough and go. yep and then he puts it in the gauntlet he's all got all of them now yeah he's like i did it all right time Finally. to do it yep and then the, the person the who why was he not here before <laughs> Yep. Thor. Yep. He shows up out of nowhere. Yep. I'm like, where were you when everybody else needed you? The one, one with the weapon that could kill Thanos. And he was and not. He was not around. <laughs> over there. Yeah. He was just killing those little minions, I guess. I guess so. so but I don't know. Yeah. He so throws that, throws that like... axe at Thanos. Mm-hmm. Hits him in the chest, basically. Yep. And he comes up to it and he starts just pushing, pushing it, it in. And like, everything. dude, just kill him. Yep. He does not. Nope. And of course, he says... Should have gone for the Should've head. Should have gone for the head. And then yep. he snaps. Yep. And, and it was in, like, what happened? He's in, well, Th- it shows Thanos. Yeah. He's in like this orange world. Inside the cell stone, basically. That's what people assume mm-hmm. is what it is. And especially considering who he finds there. Yeah. Logan Because he walks there. over, there's like a pagoda or whatever from like her home world. Mm-hmm. And baby Gamora is there. Yeah. And she's like, did you do it? Yeah. It's like, you. Like, yes. What did it cost? Yeah. Everything. Everything. <laughs> yeah, now been very memed since yep. this movie's come out. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> and she's just kind of crying and everything. Yeah. And then it goes back to outside of the soul stone. Mm-hmm. Thor's sitting there like, what did you do? Yeah. <laughs> what, what happened? Yeah. And He's he, like, bye. He, yep, he gets out of there. Yep. Just, Thanos Portals just disappears. I put, like, what I put, what do you do? I put, and then he disappears as does half the universe. Yeah. <laughs> Because yeah, they're like, what? What happened? Yeah, and here comes Bucky. Yeah, he's like Cap, Cap, and then he starts dusting away. Yeah, and I was like, no, <laughs> yeah, <laughs> oh no, so a lot of people turn to dust. Yep, Falcon. And, yep, Falcon and turns. Black Widow. No, no, she doesn't. No, no. Falcon turns. Uh, I wish I had. I, Black Panther right does. Black Panther does. Groot. Uh, Groot. Uh, let's see. Out of those, I think that uh, out of the ones that are the main ones there, I think that's all. Yeah, because Bruce, see. Black Widow, Cap, and War Machine, Koye, mm-hmm. they're all there. They're all there. And Thor. Umbaku is also fine. Yeah, yeah. He's fine. Yeah. And he's fine. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> uh, yeah. Yeah, he does not get dusted. Um, back on Titan. Almost everybody gets dusted there. Yeah, it's yeah, it was lot. rough on Titan there. Yeah, because like Drax only, goes. Yeah, Drax goes. Then Mantis. Mantis. Peter. Quill. Quill. Yeah. Uh, then Doctor Strange, Doctor Strange goes. Strange, yeah. But he tells Tony as he's going, I love you. I can't remember what he says. What do you say? He's like, I love you. We should be together. I'm so sorry that I couldn't be with you the way you wanted, but I do love you. We could have rubbed goatees. I'm sorry. Um, I don't know. What does he say? I don't remember what he says. I don't remember. I don't know. Anyway, uh, then then it's little little Peter Parker. I was, I mean, it was sad in the theater. Yeah. And I was already like on the brink of tears. Uh Uh-huh. 
But then Peter Parker starts fading away. Uh-huh. And I was like, no. He's like, Mr. Stark, I don't feel so good. And then he starts saying, but I don't, don't want to go. go. I don't want to go. And the thing is, you don't watch Doctor Who. Of course not. But when David Tennant uh-huh. regenerated. For yes. Do you, yeah, spoilers for Doctor Who from like 10 years ago or whatever. Yeah. When David Tennant regenerated yeah. into Matt Smith, basically. Uh-huh. Um, the last thing that he said was, I don't want to go. Yeah. And it broke people because because <laughs> David Tennant was a lot of, yeah, a lot of like a lot of people's him. favorite doctor. He yeah. was my favorite doctor. Yeah. Even though he wasn't my first, because usually the first doctor that you see is your favorite. Mm-hmm. But I saw Matt Smith before I saw David Tennant. I still oh, liked yeah. David Tennant better. <laughs> yeah. But um, yeah, so that's exactly what he said. <laughs> and I was like, no, <laughs> it's Doctor Who all over again. Yeah. Uh, yeah. So. And Spidey, he goes. He He's gone. He and he's like, he he's like, I'm sorry, Mr. Stark. Yeah. Oh, breaking my heart, yeah, man. That's so sad. And he's so small. He's yeah. just a little boy. He's just a little <laughs> baby. <laughs> Yeah. And he wasn't even supposed to be there. <laughs> still would have been he still staff, would have, probably. He yeah. probably still would have, but I mean, yeah. he's like, he's, you know, Tony is like his his mentor yeah, and everything. Yeah, daddy. And, yeah. Daddy. Yeah. <laughs> daddy Stark. So basically it's just Nebula it's and Tony It's Nebula now. and Tony. Yeah. That's yep. a rough go. Yep. Yep. So, I, yeah, I think we go to Wakanda. Oh, Wanda also uh, was, oh, she yeah, also Wanda's was dusted. Oh, yeah, That's right. I knew there was another person yeah. who was Wanda. Yeah. So, yeah, um, they're all dead, or not dead, but they're all yeah. dusted. Uh, we go back to Wakanda. Yeah. They're all kind of together, like, mm-hmm. oh, my gosh, what just happened? Happened. Yeah, and uh, they go like they visions dead body is there yeah. and everything, and Cap goes up to it and he's like he just kind of sits down. And he's like, oh god. Yeah, and then it cuts away from him. <laughs> yep. To, then Thanos. he goes to Thanos. Yep. Chilling, chilling on his farm. Yep. Which is the funniest thing to me for Thanos because it does in the comics too, where after he's done with all this, he just heads back to this corn farm and he's got like a scarecrow that he puts yeah. his like his armor on. Yeah. on. It's like this is my scarecrow. I'm a farmer now yeah <laughs> i just wiped out half, half the universe. universe i'm just gonna head back I'm here i'm just gonna relex now yeah my job is done dust his <laughs> hands so off weird yeah yeah and he just watches like the sunset or the sunrise yeah. or whatever and that's it mm-hmm. that's the that's movie the movie yep goes Which, to credits it's it's so funny because i always say that this is my favorite mcu movie mm-hmm. the bad guy wins yeah why do I like this movie so much? I hate movies where bad guys win. Oh, I don't know. But it's different with this one. I don't know. I just liked it so much. Yeah, it's yeah, it's good. There's no middle credit scene, no. but there is a, a end scene which I forgot about. I can't believe you forgot about this. <laughs> I mean, I was so I was in I was in disarray from everybody dying. I guess so. But it's also doesn't it say like Thanos will return. Yeah, like, it doesn't. Yeah. Uh, yeah. So and then Nick Fury and Maria Hill. Yep. They're driving along. Driving in downtown. New York. They're receiving word that some ships that, have entered Wakanda airspace. That, uh, multiple so. bogies yeah. have been spotted over Wakanda. It's, it's like, like, okay, that, that was like hours, hours ago. ago, but sure. Yeah. And then this car in front of them crashes. Mm-hmm. And like, um, the heck? Oh, Nobody's in, in it. They get out. Yeah. Maria goes over to it. She sees. There should be dust in there. Though. Yeah. Maybe it all floated out. I don't know. Sure. But um, yeah, they dust, see dust, dust. Dust uh, doesn't really get everywhere. <laughs> it's not like sand. Yeah. It's, it's very coarse. Good. And, yeah. Uh, and it goes where you want it to. Yeah. So she notices there's nobody in the car. Mm-hmm. They're a looking helicopter around. A helicopter crashes, crashes into a building. There are people like turning into dust mm-hmm. around them, basically. Maria Hill turns into yeah. dust because she's Nick. like, oh my gosh. <laughs> yeah. So she dusts. She does. She does. Yeah. Nick Fury walks over to the other side of the car. Yeah. He like waves some dust out of the way because he's like, get out of here, dusted person. Move, I Maria, gotta get move. I gotta get oh, to yeah. this thing. <laughs> get out of my way, dust face. <laughs> Uh, so he goes in there. He grabs a pager. Mm-hmm. He's about to send a message to somebody. So yeah, he grabs a pager um, from in the car. He starts to send a message. Mm-hmm. But uh oh, he starts to dust, dust too. Him. Oh no! Yeah. But he does get the page off. He does, and it drops down on the ground, mm-hmm. and it zooms into it. Yeah, it's like sending, sending, sending. Yeah, and then it sends the message, and it shows who it's being sent to. Mm-hmm. And, and it's, it's Captain, Captain Marvel, Marvel symbol. Yeah, so it's a yeah. symbol for Captain Marvel. So that's who hopefully will show up and save the day. Yep. 
We'll see. We've never seen Endgame before. <laughs> We have not. <laughs> but yeah, this the part where, because we saw it in that no- noisy theater, right? Mm-hmm. And then everybody started dying. Yeah. And some people were like, oh my God, you know, getting yeah. all upset and everything. But then like once it ends and it just cuts to black yeah. for the credits, everybody was silent. silent. There was yeah. no, no sound. It was perfect. It yeah. was great. Because everybody's just, just like, what just happened? Yeah. It was so good. That was, it made me so happy that everybody yeah. shut up during that because it was like, it's just such a good movie. And so, yeah. When when people were like dust and turning into mm-hmm. dust and everything, you could hear people like gasping around you yeah. in the theater. Cause it's, yeah. Like, and some girls, like some like college girls were talking about it, like, you know, and getting upset. And yeah. Everything, and then, yeah. You could hear some sniffles yeah. and stuff. So, yeah. I recommend seeing this movie again, even mm-hmm. if you've already seen it. Mm-hmm. All right. Well, we want to go ahead and get into our our snack do we have anything else to say about the movie i don't think so i think okay i I will say this you know when this movie came out Mm -hmm. one thing that kind of ruined it is that they had already put out the schedule for the next movies Mm -hmm. and so it was like oh the next spider-man movie and the next black panther black panther 2 and all this stuff and it's like well, obviously, these people are going to be coming back if, if they're going <laughs> yeah. to have their own movie, if they're going to have like sequel movies and stuff. Yeah, yeah, they did. And, like the that. next and Guardians Volume Three and everything. Yeah. <laughs> so it was like people knew that they were going to come back eventually. Right. They yeah, had totally telegraphed them. Yeah. My only problem was that I knew we were going to have to wait so long for Endgame, mm-hmm. and I was just like, "Dang it, man!" I mean, it was only like a year. Yeah, but that was forever. That was a long time. It took so long. I wanted it like. I wanted it now. Yeah. It's like the problem I had with Across the Universe. It's like... Across the Spider-Verse. Yeah, Spider-Verse. Yeah. Sorry. No, the movie Across the Universe. <laughs> like, There's not the a sequel Beatles to that. movie. You're uh, still waiting for the sequel yeah, to that. And it's like, it's been years. When are we getting that? Come on, Ringo. The, but yeah, it's just... Uh, I hate waiting this long for to uh, some resolution there. Yeah. So, yeah. But, yep. I, I kind of want to watch Endgame, like, right now. <laughs> like, <laughs> before we even watch it for the podcast. You're going to have to wait. We'll see. Sorry. I mean, you don't have to. I mean, I guess <laughs> as soon as you go back to your yeah. apartment, you could watch it without it's me. Possible. But... <sighs> we'll see. But, yeah. All right. Well, let's get to the snack then. Okay. It smells like ice cream, kind of. So, this week we are having cotton candy flavored icing Oreos. So, it's the white Oreos Mm -hmm. with pink and blue frost icing. Yeah, cotton candy flavored Mm -hmm. icing, frosting, whatever. And are you, you're not a cotton candy flavored fan? I like cotton candy. I don't like cotton candy flavored things. Right. Because they, I don't know if they still make it, but I know they used to have cotton candy flavored bubble gum. Mm Mm-hmm. Absolutely hated it. And the bubble yum stuff, the bubblicious or whatever. Yeah. I think it was bubblicious, yeah. but I did not like it. Yeah, I don't remember if I had it or not. I feel like I've had other cotton candy flavored things. I just don't like. It. I I love cotton candy. Yeah, but there it's just it just doesn't translate. Not to me. So we'll see if this we'll see. can do the unthinkable. I hope so because this is a lot of Oreos. If not, <laughs> it's pretty cotton candy. It can do in the. <laughs> yeah, it does have a cotton candy taste. Mm-hmm. But it also it also tastes like pure food dye. Like I can taste the food dye. I don't know that I'm getting that, but maybe. I don't think it's that bad. You not a fan? <laughs> <laughs> not really. <laughs> Like I'm taking these home this time. <laughs> Please do. <laughs> whenever we have, you will eat them, regardless. No, well, just whenever we have snacks, mm-hmm. they end up staying here, <laughs> and then I eat them all. <laughs> Even if they're the terrible. Even if they're wafer nasty. Satellite wafer, satellite wafer candy. <laughs> I eat every single bit of it. I need to not eat this. <laughs> my house, I'll be like, I really want something sweet. Mm-hmm. And then I'll go, well, I mean, I do have those Oreos. I'm alive. But, but they are <laughs> sweet. <laughs> exactly. <laughs> and so I will eat them. I will eat this whole package of Oreos. <laughs> You've got to take them. You've got to okay. take, them. You have okay. to take them out of this apartment. I will. So what are we going to rate them, though? I mean, these aren't, like, blowing my mind good or anything. 
Yeah. So they're not, I don't think they're bad. I think I'm giving them like a six. I think I'm going to give them like five. It's like okay. middle of the road kind of thing. I don't absolutely hate them. This is mm-hmm. not cotton candy flavor bubble gum. Mm-hmm. That would be probably a two. Yeah. This is a five. I think the cookie covers up a lot of it. I think so. So even if you don't like the cotton candy. And I do like their vanilla cookies. Yeah. They're good. Mm-hmm. All right. Well then... Were you happy Thanos won also, like Krista? <laughs> no. Is that why this is your favorite movie also? <laughs> you can let us know on, oh gosh, X. Oh. Ugh. We may just get rid of that account just because I hate it. I hate it so, so much. much. As soon so as it stupid. changed on my phone to X, I was just like, Ugh. yeah. Twitter it turns is my now stomach X. every time I look at my phone now. It's so when stupid. I, I want to check it, and then mm-hmm. I look at at the icon, and I'm just like, Ugh, I don't. Do I want to check it? Yeah, I don't check it anymore. So I just never get on there. It's the worst. So we may be no longer using <laughs> X. Yeah. Well, until we decide to quit, we're at having fun cast, and then on Facebook at having fun pod. Mm-hmm. And of course, you can find us. Uh, through email at havingfunpod at gmail.com. Mm-hmm. We also have an Instagram. We do. We don't talk about it, but we have an Instagram. Because I can't remember exactly what it is. I, I think, think it's just having, having fun, fun podcast. Podcast? Okay. So there you go. If it's not, I mean... It'll probably... You'll probably find it probably somehow find it. that way. If so. you, yeah. If you just type in having yeah. fun podcast, it's probably there. There you go. All right. Well, go have fun and we'll see you next week. Goodbye. Bye.